హలో ఐఎమ్ డాక్టర్ రాజారాం రెడ్డి యు బీన్ డయాగ్నోస్ విత్ రెట్నల్ కండిషన్ ద వీడియో యూఆర్ అబౌట్ టు వాచ్ ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్స్ అబౌట్ యువర్ కండిషన్ అండ్ ద రిస్క్ అండ్ బెనిఫిట్స్ ఆఫ్ యువర్ రికమెండెడ్ ట్రీట్మెంట్ చూసింగ్ టు అండర్ గో ఎనీ ఫార్మ్ ఆఫ్ ట్రీట్మెంట్ ఆర్ సర్జరీ కెన్ బీ అ డిఫికల్ట్ డెసిషన్ టు మేక్ వల్ సమ్ పీపుల్ మే ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ సైడ్ ఎఫెక్ట్స్ ఫ్రమ్ ద మెడికేషన్స్ ఆర్ సర్జరీ ద రిస్క్ ఆఫ్ సైడ్ ఎఫెక్ట్స్ షుడ్ ఆల్వేస్ బీ బ్యాలెన్స్డ్ విత్ గ్రేటర్ రిస్క్ ఆఫ్ లీవింగ్ యువర్ కండిషన్ అన్ట్రీటెడ్ విచ్ మే ఇంక్లూడ్ లాస్ ఆఫ్ విజన్ హియర్ ఎట్ నియర్ ఎట్ నా ఐ కేర్ వీ ఆర్ కమిటెడ్ టు హెల్పింగ్ యూ కీప్ యువర్ ఐ సైడ్ ఆల్ ఆఫ్ అర్స్ ఇంక్లూడింగ్ మై సెల్ఫ్ డాక్టర్ శ్రీనివాస్ డాక్టర్ అల్కా అండ్ డాక్టర్ పురుషోత్తమ్ లుక్ ఫార్వర్డ్ టు హెల్పింగ్ యూ థ్యాంక్ యూ Your ophthalmologist has diagnosed your eye condition as cystoid macular edema. This is where fluid builds up in the tissue at the back of your eye, including the area responsible for your central vision, causing blurry or distorted vision. To treat your cystoid macular edema, your doctor recommends injections of medication in your eye. This medication can help reduce swelling in the back of the eye, which helps to improve your vision. To understand how cystoid macular edema affects your vision, let's take a look at how the eye works. Light rays enter the eye through the cornea, pupil, and lens. These light rays are focused on the retina, the light-sensitive tissue lining the back of the eye. The retina has two areas, the peripheral retina, which gives us our side or wide-angle vision, and the macula, the small area at the center of the retina. The macula gives us our pinpoint vision, allowing us to see detail clearly. With cystoid macular edema, blood vessels in the retina begin to leak. When this occurs, it can cause the macula to swell or thicken. Because the macula is responsible for our central or pinpoint vision, macular edema will affect your ability to see clearly. Your ophthalmologist will treat your macular edema with a medication injection inside your eye. This medication can reduce swelling of the macula, which helps to slow vision loss or perhaps even improve vision. Your ophthalmologist will determine how many injections you need over a period of time. To prepare for your medication injection, your ophthalmologist will clean your eye to prevent infection and numb it with anesthesia to reduce discomfort during the injection. Your pupils may be dilated or widened with dilating eye drops. The medication is injected into the vitreous or jelly-like substance in the center of the eye. You may feel pressure in your eye when the medication is injected. As with any medication or procedure, there are risks of side effects and complications with medication injection. These may include eye pain, a bloodshot eye, small specks in your vision called floaters, inflammation or swelling of the eye, retinal detachment, which is when the retina pulls away from the back of the eye, clouding of the lens of the eye or cataract, increased pressure in the eye called glaucoma, damage to the retina, cornea or lens, bleeding, eye infection, vision loss, and the need for more treatment, including medication and surgery. Though it is very rare, it is possible for some people using certain types of medications to have a stroke, hemorrhage, or heart attack. Tell your ophthalmologist if you've had a heart attack or stroke in the last few months. Any or all of these complications may decrease your vision or possibly even cause blindness. Additional procedures may be needed to treat these complications. Other forms of treatment may be available for your case of macular edema. These options could include other types of medications or vitrectomy surgery to remove scar tissue from the macula. Your ophthalmologist can explain why he or she chose these medication injections for your particular course of treatment. You don't have to be treated for your cystoid macular edema. However, without treatment, macular edema likely will lead to more vision loss. The main goal of treating macular edema is to improve your vision. Be sure to keep all appointments with your ophthalmologist after treatments. Also, if you have any changes in your vision, you should call your ophthalmologist right away. Monitoring your vision is a vital step toward the goal of preserving your sight. Music